All right, uh, what I'm going to show you now is how to store data into your calculator. Once the information is stored in here, even when you turn your calculator off, it will still be there. All right, so if you turn your calculator on, and we're going to hit stat here, stat, and the first mode here is edit. So we just hit enter. And what you're going to notice is that it's going to display multiple lists here. So these are all the lists that I had stored from previous problems. Now what we're going to do is we're going to store the 12 heights of Ocean View Basketball Varsity players, which uh, was already given to you. So notice if I want to exit, I want to delete these numbers here, I just simply scroll up and highlight list one and then hit clear right here. I just hit clear and then enter. And what that will do is that will exit out everything there. Now I'm going to enter in the 12 heights in any order I want. I just put them in the order that's given to me just for convenience. Now after each time I enter in a number, I just hit enter in the lower right. And once the information is stored in here, you'll be able to graph, um, do any type of function you want. So notice I have here, I want to make sure that the, the little subscript here in parentheses is 12, which means that this is the 12th number is 73, and L1 is list 1 here. All right, that's how you store data into your calculator. And what I want you to notice, if I hit second, quit, quit is in yellow, so when I hit the second button, it's yellow, it's going to access any yellow button I hit. I go to the home screen here, and even if I turn the calculator off and then back on again, if I go to stat, edit, it has my original list there. Another way to access that list, if I go to quit again, if I just hit second L1, which is above one, second L1, what that does is it puts L1 here, and if I just hit enter, it will display the list in a horizontal fashion. So that is list one, that is the heights that the rest of the uh, tutorial videos, I'm going to use this list right here to do multiple tasks. Thank you.